Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Before we get started, have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button on my main page. And once you have done this, don't forget to click on that bell to be the first to get notified when I upload a new video. In today's video, I will be showing you 5 ways to fix Battlefield from crashing, not starting up and just freezing all the time. To start off with, first you need to go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and click on the start menu. You now need to find Battlefield 5, so start typing in Battlefield and you now need to right click on Battlefield 5 and go open file location. You now need to right click on the shortcut file and go down to properties. We now need to go across to compatibility and you now need to tick the run this program as administrator option and press apply and we can now go ahead and press OK. Once you have done that you now need to right click on the shortcut again and go open file location and you now need to go into installer folder at the top and you now need to click on the VC folder and VC 2015 and you now need to click on this folder here and you now need to run the version for your computer. If you're not sure what version or windows you do have you can go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and right click and go to system. And as you can see my system type is a 64-bit operating system which means I need to run the 64.exe here if you've got a 32-bit operating system, then you need to run the x86 setup file. I'm now going to double-click on this setup file, and I now need to go I agree and install. And as you can see, it says setup failed, and that is because I already have Visual C++ 2015 installed on my computer. But if you don't, then you need to follow the setup instructions. Once you have done that, we now need to head on over to the website for our graphics card. I've got a NVIDIA graphics card, so I need to go to NVIDIA.com. And you now need to download the latest graphics card drivers for your computer. As they are always getting updated, and if you're not running the latest graphics card drivers for your machine, Battlefield will not run. Once you have updated all your graphics card drivers, you now need to restart your computer. And once you have restarted your computer, you now need to disable any antivirus programs you have on your machine. I'm now going to go down to the bottom right hand corner of my screen and right click on a fast. And I'm just going to disable all the shields for a hour, just so I can test Battlefield 5. Once you have done this, you now need to go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen again and you need to type in firewall and you need to open up Windows Defender Firewall. Once this is open, you now need to click on allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall and you now need to scroll down until you find Battlefield 5 and you just need to make sure the private option is ticked. You can always tick the public option as well if you want to just be safe. But as you can see, mine is just ticked on private and Battlefield 5 works absolutely fine on my machine. Once you have done this, you can now boot up Battlefield 5 and fingers crossed it will now work. If it doesn't work, then make sure you are running the latest version of Windows 10 by going into Windows Update. And if you have figured out a way to fix Battlefield 5, but I have not said about it today in this video, please comment below and help everyone else out. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.